Let's bring him on the next Big Bell. All right, folks, this is for the BTW Cruiserweight Championship, and we've got quite a challenger here, one Billy Blade. Rocking out. Rocking out, Billy Blade, man. Let me tell you something, Billy Blade and I, we spent a lot of time on Sunset Strip, you know, back back in those glam days. Let me tell you something, chickadees involved? Oh, yeah, plenty of chickadees. So many that I can't even mention. Yes. You can't mention them because there weren't any. Oh, yeah, there were plenty. Jason Styles was in the mix. It was, it was quite, quite a time. He is from the Hollywood Hills, Billy Blade. He is the challenger. And there, right there, there's your Cruiserweight Champion, one of the more popular wrestlers in BTW, part of that great tag team shoot to thrill, now on on his own, very successful both as a tag team and a singles wrestler. One of the most athletic wrestlers that we have in the BTW stable, and that is one, Kimo Kenelo. Yes, and also he's one of the most selfish individuals I know. How's that? He dropped his partner, Mike Silva, like that. Kimo Kanaloa, you know what, you don't know anything. Shooter Mike Silva has been on the disabled list almost for a full year. But let me tell you something. Kimo Kanaloa, how many times did Kimo Kanaloa visit Mike Silva in the hospital? Not once, zero. He left him out in the lurch and he went. All right, will you stop? Are, are you done? He abandoned Mike Silva. He did not abandon him. Mike Silva made an appearance here just earlier this evening and he was with Kimo. And they were having a good time, and Kimo, like everybody else, saw that, that Mike Silva was having difficulty and even offered to help him out. Uh, except for you, you're the most selfish person, individual, in BTW. From what I heard, Mike Silva didn't once receive a visit from Kimo Kanaloa. We heard from who? Because when I was there with Mike Silva, who comes in but Kimo Kanaloa and his beautiful, lovely young wife after sending flowers? No, 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 you're wrong. I, I want to know who stole uh, Mike Silva's fruit cup, too, in the hospital. When he, when, he, when he got his food and he was asleep, who stole the fruit cup, Dragon Dave? Is this birthday present for me? <laughs> yeah, yeah. That present is for you. And you can open it at any time you like. Uh, now it's moved over here to your side of the, the, the building. Folks, let's get back to the action here. This is for the BTW Cruiserweight title. Your champion, as you well know, Dragon Dave, pay attention, is Chemo. And this is Billy Blade, the challenge. Well, well, one thing I can say about this box is that it smells good. And I don't have a fork and knife, so I'm mean, just going to let you know right then and there. Well, well, whatever it is, don't eat it. And just leave it alone, because if you start moving it around, it may agitate them. Mm, it's not edible? Well, no. Oh, my I am hungry. Did I tell you that? Several times. Yeah. There's a pizza place, so, you know, just, just around the corner, you know. There is. Oh, yeah, there is a very good one, I, I understand. I think it's birthday. Did I mention that? No, I, I don't believe. Well, yes, I think you might have mentioned it in passing. Billy Blade not getting too many accolades here. Kimo Canaloa ready to go. Kimo Canaloa is not only a very good technical wrestler, he's a high flyer, he's very athletic, and he's very strong. So, uh, And he's got an arsenal of absolutely devastating moves. And the, the series that he had with Shannon Ballard, I think, goes down as one of the greatest series ever of Cruiserweight title matches. And he's very well known for abandoning his tag team partners. Folks, this is what I have to put up with. Week after week, month after month, year after year. I, I, I'll be very curious to, to see when Mike Silva comes. Because Mike Silva will be back. He will be back anytime. And I'll be very interested to see how Mike Silva feels about Kimo Kenlo and his success. Well, you'd better stay away from him. That's the only thing I want to see is Mike Silva needs to come back without somebody like you getting involved. I sent Mike Silva a lot of presents, a lot of gifts. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, they're all, yeah. 
I got to watch my charge card. There's a leg pick, and Billy Blake goes in there and kicks Hemo right in the right in the kidney. I sent those flowers and all the candy. Cod. He signed for him. He signed for them. Are the world's biggest cheapskate. He signed for them. That means he accepted them. You know, but it's just the gesture that counts. The gesture of sending him present. Cod. You are unbelievable. He signed for it. That means he wanted them. The depths that you sink to. I, I, they're lower than the Titanic. Mike Silva had the cash on demand and he took the presents. Well, there's taking an opportunity. Test the strength there, and Billy Blade goes in with the boot. Side headlock. Down goes the Cruiserweight champion. Oh, and just missed that. Oh, he got some comeuppance there as he spat down on, on the water on Kimo Kendall. Oh, beautiful. Look at the height of that drop kick, folks. Billy Blade doesn't know where he is. Run into a rock of love, let me tell you that. Whoa. Oh. Sinton. Those are punishing. That, that, the, the, the Hawaiian cannon, I think. That is in the Hawaiian cannonball. Yes, exactly. Not to be confused with the Wabash cannonball. Exactly. Billy Blade is taking a breather out here. He deserves one. And Kimo Canelo is taking it to the floor. Taking it to the floor. How unsportsmanlike. Unsportsman. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. Billy Blade tried for a leg drop. Look at that beautiful springboard elbow drop. Like I was saying, folks, Kimo Canelo is absolutely a dazzling wrestle, wrestler to watch. Yes, it looks like he's singling right here for a, for a forearm smash, but Billy Blade was two steps ahead of him. Man, that was a beautiful move, really. That, that was a gorgeous counter. Well scouted, beautiful flowing move. Uh, folks, when you're in a situation like that and a clothesline is coming at you, these wrestlers have such great reaction times and are able to turn that around and use the other wrestler's momentum against them to pull off a move like that. Great job by Billy Blade. And now Kimo's in big trouble. Exactly, and so is his title. That this is a title match. Yes, and the next thing you know, when Kimo Kanaloa loses his title, he's gonna crawl back to Mike Silva, ask him to reunite. And you are just, you are just stirring the pot, aren't you? Ouch. Speak to Mike Silva. I think he and I need to have a little talk. You stay away from shooter Mike Silva. He's got enough problems. Ducks out of there, does chemo. Lights up the chest of Billy Blake. Billy Blake can't see where he is. Oh, no. And he gets nailed right with a beautiful. Who was the referee? The referee should have allowed that. You know, Billy Blake couldn't see. What is this, a dark match? But, um, this is a Gates State Roberts versus uh, Rick Martell in a blindfold match here. What? I mean, Billy Blake couldn't see right then and there. The referee should have stepped in. You know what I mean? Well, the referee couldn't see either because he was adjusting his goggles. Oh, and a clothesline finds the mark. And down goes Kimo. Now Billy Blake needs to take advantage of the situation. What a slow count on the part of goggles there. I must say, you've been complaining about the slow count all night. You're like one of these whiny major league players on the Los Angeles Dodgers who moans and bemoans about the strike zone half the night. The count is what it is. Beautiful duck under there by Kimo. Boot right to the groin. Signaling for that big forearm. Oh, Billy Blake ducks it again. Oh, and nails him. The beautiful cross kick, scissor kick, right to the back of the head. And if I was the referee in this match, I would be counting, you know, like, like you wouldn't believe. Yeah, I don't believe you'd be counting. Exactly. Uh, you'd be counting like I wouldn't believe, and I don't believe you'd be counting. One, two, three. There it is. Over. Over here right there. One, two, three. Over. I'm telling you right now. The shoulders weren't down for that long. I would be, you know, like, I would be the only referee I know who'd probably work on tips. I wouldn't be offended by cash. I wouldn't be offended by cash. <laughs> Somebody else. Oh, 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 look at this. This is absolutely punishing. Yes. Chemo guitar. Yes, he's playing, you know. Look what look look look, look what Billy Blade dragged in right there. Chemo Kenalo on the floor. On the mat. Chemo's your cruiserweight champion. I mean that I don't know folks if you can see on your monitors, but Chemo's chest is absolutely lit up with handprints. 
Well, that just goes to show you that Billy Blade is putting it on uh, uh, Kimo Kanaloa. Oh, sunset flip, beautiful, rolls him through. Oh, Kimo gets nailed again by another cross kick by Billy Blade. This Billy's got some dangerous feet. It's not a sunset flip. It's a sunset strip. That's what you call it in this particular match because of Billy Blade. Pardon. It's French talk. Yes. Right now, Billy Blade is taking it outside the ring. And uh, this is a dangerous place to be, folks. That hard one. Oh, God. You know, this Billy Blade has such effective kicks. They've really neutralized a lot of the, the moves of Kim. Uh oh. This isn't going to be good for anybody. See, the guy's about a ticket for that seat. Yes, and whoa, and he, he reversed it. There you go. He's entitled to do that. Little cat and mouse game there by Billy Blade, but I wouldn't taunt the audience like that, you know. The audience in the Newark Pavilion is your third man in the ring. Oh, man. Look at that. He, he calls this the Rainbow Room. Rainbow Room. Or is, or is it the Troubadour? I'm not sure. Uh, the, the Troubadour. I'm not, sure. not a Picador. Alright, not a matador. You wouldn't know anything about this. You know what I'm talking about. Watch bullfighting, and I put up with a lot of bull, which is you. Kimo in there, ducks under that elbow. Oh! Beautiful, beautiful flying neck breaker on Kimo Kanaloa, but he can't capitalize because he's been getting the, the, the uh, coconut kicked out of him for the past 10 minutes. Yes. Crowd on his side, though. Come on, Kimo, get up there. And right now, uh, Kimo, and Kimo's back. He's got, he's got a second win right there. Two big smashes there to the kisser of Billy Blade. Billy Blade tries for a hip. Oh, oh and gets nailed with a clothesline. Another high elevation drop kick. Boy, this kid's such an athlete. It's unbelievable. Oh, spinning clothesline. Good night, Billy Blade. One, two. Oh, two and three quarters. Two, two and seven eighths. Well, I mean, let me tell you, Billy Blade still has, still has some more to give. He still has some uh, gas on that tank of his. And uh, he's not ready to give up just that easily. And what is this? What we got here? Look at Kimo. Whoa. Round and over. Turn around, Billy Blade. Kimo didn't go anywhere. There's a beautiful shoulder block. Oh, springboard. Oh, that's one of his stellar moves here. And a cover. One, two, almost three. Oh, folks, this is unbelievable. Well, let me tell you something. Right now, Billy Blade needs to somehow get his... Get his act together, and uh, I'm looking forward to seeing uh, you know Billy Blade uh, you know win this match. As a matter of fact, you know, hopefully with the backstage pass. Stage pass. Uh oh, Kimo's in trouble here. Oh man, that's it. Backstage pass, right there. That's what he calls it. That is unbelievable. Oh, one, two. That's got a new cruiserweight champion. Oh, only two. Wow, that is un, un that is unbelievable. I counted in my head three. Yeah, and if you were, if you were the referee, the emperor is seven foot two. Well, kick right to the sternum there. Oh, he ducks out of there. Kimo was waiting for him. You see, eyes open. Oh, here it is. This is the move that puts everybody away. Good night. That's the pineapple drop. One, two, and three. Good night, Billy Blade. Kimo still the champion. Hard fought win though. This should not count. Billy Billy had this match won with the backstage pass. I counted one, two, three. Goggles just counted way too slow in that match. I, I, I cannot believe this. Goggles counted way too slow. Five minutes ago, you were complaining he was counting too fast. When, when Billy Blade had his shoulders down. Now you're saying he counted too slow? Well, Goggles goes back and forth. Goes back and forth. Look at this. Yeah, from one, one end of the ring to the other. Kimo Canaloa is still your Cruiserweight champion after a pretty good effort there by Billy Blade. Folks, we've got two great double main events coming up. Tag team titles on the line. Irresistible Jason Styles versus Brutus the Barber Beefcake. Folks, we've got some great matches coming up. Stay with us. 